Hey lovies, welcome back to my channel. So because of all the requests I've been getting on my Instagram page to recreate this blue smoky eye that I did a lot while back, I decided that okay, let me do it, but change it a bit. Let me make it pink. So this is what y'all were asking. So I hope you guys will enjoy this video and I hope you will like, comment and subscribe and watch how I created this badass look guys look at that glow Ooh. all that goodness in one human being it ain't fair so first thing i go in with my base on my eyelid so you guys because exams are coming up i have decided that i will stop posting the videos for wednesday and then i'll just post on saturday and then it will be like the videos that I'll post on Saturday of makeup looks will be like a chit chat type of vibe where I speak about maybe what I wanted to talk about on Wednesday on Saturday's video where I also do my makeup so it will be like a chit chat get ready with me and I'll try by all means to make sure that my videos remain below 15 minutes 15 minutes would be like extreme even so yeah i'll try to edit as much as i can with my nyx bright palette transition color will be this pink I'll here just put this in my crease then after packing it on i start blending it out then to define my crease even more, I'm going in with this purple here. I'm going to put it like below that pink, a little bit below that pink. And just pack it on first. Until so you get the color you want, then you start to blend it out. Then to blend out the purple, I'm going back to my transition color, this pink here. I'm going to use it to blend the purple. The trick with a smoky eye is, is to blend your colors. You need to make sure that all your colors blend together perfectly. Like, it's a seamless blend. And after that, I then go in with my Kachal liner. It's black. I want to use this as the base so that my black can pop like properly. So I just place this where I know I want to put the black, which is all over my lid. You guys, uh... In November, I bought fake makeup. <laughs> I bought fake makeup. Is it fake or is it a dupe? I don't know, but I bought fake makeup in the streets of Astrakhan. Well, not in the street streets, but in the mall. But fakey. You'll see, I'll use the palette today. And it's actually good. It's not bad, bad. Like, it's not bad, bad. But it's good. So you need to make sure that this base of yours spreads properly and evenly. So that it does not create chunks or lumps on your lid when you put in the black. The more I bought a Jaclyn Hill palette. Well, it's a fake Jaclyn Hill palette because the original does not look anything like this and i've seen the original a friend of mine has it but i needed this palette and this is like the shades inside it does the things until i can get my hands on the original when i go home so i need i'm going to use this black here and i'm just going to pack that onto my lid To blend the black into the purple and the pink i go back i use the purple again first because i don't want any lines of demarcation so i just first pack like that and then i spread it i use the pink to blend all these colors together here and just create a proper transition and then i go back to the black again i keep on putting it black i keep, I keep on putting it back on 
continue to blend until I get the consistency that I want. Mm. Blend out properly, I then go in with this big buff blending brush and I just blend all these colors together. For the inner corner highlight, I go back to this palette again and I mix two shades. I miss I mix this pink is it reddish and pink one here and I just put that in my inner corner is my inner corner highlights because I love inner corner highlight guys so now I'm just going to do my foundation be using my Estee Lauder double wear foundation for this look because I feel like it's an intense look so it needs like full coverage yes it needs a full coverage thing so i'm going to use this estee lauder foundation on my face oh, okay so i'll be back so as you can see i'm done with my face so for the lower lash line i will first start with my essence pencil eyeliner in the shade black number one line of mine that I used before up there I'm just going to smudge it here so that the black can stick smudge it like that then I go in with black eyeshadow and I just try and press it on onto the the line that i don't put more product here and unless i feel the need to then i just use this now to sm to s blend then after that one i'm going back with the pink brush there but i feel like i need the pink to pop more so I'm gonna go back a little bit to that pink shadow and yeah. my big shot mascara Maybelline For my lips for my lips essence liner in honeyberry like that the next um soft matte lip cream in the shade canes my og face I love this color then I just put it in the center of my lips I'm not done because I still need to put on my lashes so I'll be right back to put those on but I love this look hey have it you guys the final look I don't know what to call it because the last one I did, I called it Raccoon Eyes. So, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you will like, comment, subscribe, and share, okay? Invite more people to come and see all this greatness, all this goodness. And by the way, since you've reached this point, you've watched thus far, and you still haven't subscribed, like, what exactly are you trying to say? Like, you might as well just subscribe, like, you got this far. Please, please subscribe with love from me to you. May the good Lord ever stay blessing you.